It's a big grand opening in South Tulsa. The whole food store at 91st and Yale is now open, and the crowds are just pouring in. The new at 6 2 News reporter Dan Perlman is live with what the store means for that area. Dan? Well, the foot traffic in and out of here is more or less nonstop. This really is the place to be in South Tulsa. And I found out this store is the next step in helping this entire area flourish. Inside this store, number one, the healthy foods, a big draw. My husband is a big fan of the soup, soup bar too. Whole Foods hits South Tulsa. We've been counting the days for this to open. Now it's a place to shop. When we first moved in, there were no grocery stores. Close to home. This is a good thing for this part of Tulsa. Whole Foods itself is not new to Tulsa. It's just new to this area. A part of town once rural. Now one of the city's top draws for stores and restaurants. Well, there's been a lot of interest in this area. The Tammy Fate with really the city of Tulsa area. tells me the interest is in who lives here. Within five minutes of 91st and Yale, the average household income is around 115000 On top of that, during the day, she says more than 7,500 people work within a short drive. Business owners are catching on. There's just a lot of growth and a lot of uh, retailers really seeing that there's there's an interest and there's a demand in Tulsa. And now Whole Foods, a store fate calls an anchor to draw more retail. A nearby grocery store. Now we can run here. For the rising demand. Probably won't be able to keep my husband away from the soup. Faye told me more businesses are looking right now at moving into this area. Announcements on who should be coming very soon. Live in South Tulsa, Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you. All right, Dan, thanks. A lot of people in South Tulsa happy to see that store. Well, coming up 